almost um, 18 years ago, I was a young woman growing up in Canada, and I loved wrestling. I saw these beautiful athletic women doing what I loved, and I thought to myself, that's what I want to do. So I found a wrestling school, and I knew after that very first day that that was what I was born to do. Yeah. Sorry, I'm a little emotional tonight. There's not a lot of women or people that can say that their dreams can come true. But I can tell you, I'm telling all of you, especially the young women out there, that with hard work, a lot of sacrifice, and fighting for what you believe in, that dreams can come true. And I am living proof. And I couldn't have done it. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I, um, I honestly couldn't have done it without the ladies that paved the road for me and all the women who have taken this journey with me. Women like Trish Stratus, Lita, Molly Holly, Awesome Kong, and Taryn Terrell, just to name a few. After Bound for Glory, I had um, a lot of time to reflect. And I can honestly say that I can say I have a full heart and a heart of peace with making my decision. So tonight, I am relinquishing the title. But I am so excited to see what's next for my life, to see what's next in this next chapter. And I'm so, and I'm so excited and even more excited to see what's next for Ali and the knockouts who are gonna carry this legacy of strong, powerful women in this business. So thank you to Impact Wrestling for making my dreams come true. And most importantly, the fans. Thank you so much. I love you. I would never have made it this far without you. I am so proud to be a knockout champion one last time. And with that, good luck, ladies, and thank you. Truly an emotional night for Gail Kim as she relinquishes the Knockouts Championship after a valiant victory less than two weeks ago at Bound for Glory. What does this mean for the Knockouts Championship?